What's up Airsofters, welcome to Lancer Tactical TV. I'm David and today I'm going to talk to you about the many different variants of the new Lancer Tactical Generation 2 M4A1. Externally, these new guns have been upgraded to a new high-strength nylon polymer. This will seriously increase the external durability of these new Generation 2 M4s. In addition to the nylon polymer, you'll find that these new M4s also come with a full metal outer barrel, full metal front sight, and a full metal charging candle. Internally, all of these M4s are going to be very similar. The externals are going to be where most of the differences between the five models exist. Now let's go on to the internals of these guns. The internals of all five rifles are going to be fairly similar. First, we have a rotary style hop-up. This is a big upgrade over the wheel style hop-up that was in the Generation 1. Next, moving to the barrel, it's a 603 tight bore barrel. This new hop-up and tight bore barrel give you a very good effective range. Oh, I hit him! Oh, man! We found that this gun does best with 0.25 gram BBs or 0.28 gram BBs. So, if you're using indoor, I would personally recommend that you use 0.25 gram BBs. If you're playing outdoor, I would recommend 0.28 gram BBs. That'll give you the best range and accuracy with these new Generation 2. All right, now that we've talked about the accuracy, let's move back to the gearbox. The gearbox has received some major upgrades as well. This gun is coming with full metal gears and a full rack of 16 metal teeth on the piston. That means that every single tooth in this gearbox is full metal. This will really add to the internal durability and longevity of your gun. In addition, this gearbox is going to come with low resistance silver wiring and aluminum trigger contacts. This is going to give you a better flow of current and it will give you a much snappier trigger response. Another thing that's going to add to the trigger response of this gun as compared to the Generation 1 is that we've added neo magnets into the motor. We've also upgraded the battery from an 8.4 volt to a 9.6. To install the battery into your front wired versions, you'll pull back here on the delta ring. This handguard will come into two pieces and you will be able to place your battery up underneath the bottom. Plug it in and then put your handguard back together and push the delta ring back into place. To install the battery into your rear wired version of these M4s, just remove this butt pad. Then take the two sides of your nunchuck battery and insert them on either side of the stock and then put the butt pad back on. So you're going to find that, that wiring upgrade, battery upgrade and motor upgrade are all going to seriously increase the trigger response of this new Generation 2 M4. To top it all off, we've added a quick change spring into this gearbox. That way, if the FPS isn't exactly what you want, you can go in, pull the spring, and change it out very quickly. And while we're talking about FPS, let's move on to the chrono test. As you see by the chrono numbers, these guns are very consistent between their high shots and their low shots. They only have about a 5 FPS variance. This is a sign of a healthy piston and gearbox. Now moving on to the shooting test, you can see this gun has good accuracy at close range. It also has a lot of great distance. Because of the good quality hop-up bucking that we use and the 603 type bore in the barrel, you'll find that your shots really reach out past the 150 foot range. Remember though, if you want this distance, make sure you're using 0.28 or 0.25 gram BBs. 0.2s are not going to give you this range. Another awesome thing about these Generation 2 M4s is if you wind this magazine up all the way, it'll fire every single round without you having to wind it again. I've never seen another high cap that will do this same thing. Alright guys, let's move on to one of the best parts, the price. This is an entry level rifle, so it's going to have a very affordable price tag. These guns are just a bit above 100, but they're going to come with everything you need to start playing airsoft except your mask. That's going to be your gun, your included high cap magazine, your included 9.6 volt battery, your included charger which has a light to let you know when your battery is done charging, a starter pack of BBs, a Lancer Tactical patch, and a fairly detailed manual. After you purchase this package, all you'll need before you play your first game is some face and eye protectors. I've already taken these rifles to JTAC Milsim and to Lion Claws Milsim, and they seem to keep up very well with the high level guns that everyone else was using at these Milsim events. All in all, I think this is a great beginner gun. It would also be a great loner gun or backup gun. So guys, if you're looking for a very affordable M4 with a sturdy gearbox and sturdy nylon polymer externals, look no further than the Lancer Tactical M4A1. These are available now at your local Lancer Tactical dealer. I'm David, this is Lancer Tactical TV, and until next time, Airsofters, strike hard, strike fast.